Hey, what's going on everybody? Today we're working on a 2008 Toyota Corolla here. The reason it's here is because it's got uh, alternator issues, supposedly. Uh, start up the car, it dies, drains out the battery. So uh, if you guys are having alternator issues, I'll show you guys a little trick here. All it's gonna cost you is a can of brake clean. So first, what you wanna do is make sure you guys check here in the fuse box. You got a five amp fuse right over here, this guy right here. Check that fuse and make sure that it's not burnt out. If that's burnt out, then you wanna make sure you replace that and see what happens after that. If it keeps burning out, then maybe you gotta replace the alternator and gotta replace the alternator. But if you guys tried already and replaced your alternator and your fuse is good and you're still having the same problems, what you gotta do is have somebody go inside of the car and step on the throttle and give it some gas until you take like two, three thousand RPMs and check your voltage here in the negative and positive and see if they go up. If they do go up and you're getting 13.5 volts, 14 volts when somebody hits the gas pedal, then your alternator is not the problem. The problem, uh, if you are getting good voltage on that one after the throttle, the problem is going to be that the engine's not running right, which is what uh, issue we had over here. So uh, when we just let it idle, what happens is the engine would shake and it just wouldn't run right and uh, the idle would go to like 400 RPMs. And uh, the problem in this case was check your uh, throttle body. This is the throttle body over here. Take out this boot. And a lot of times these get dirty and they don't, uh, the engine just can't breathe right. And it, it runs real bad and gets the RPMs all low. And when the RPMs are low, the alternator doesn't have enough power to get the, the voltage up. So take a, a can of brake clean, open this up. And then uh, you can have somebody inside with the key on, engine off, hit the gas pedal. What it'll do is open up that butterfly in the throttle body. And then I clean the plate up top on the bottom all around the throttle body. And then uh, put everything back together and start it up and that should take care of your problem. So yeah, that's what we did here. We cleaned the throttle body up and uh, turn on the car. And sure enough, the, it idled fine. and. Uh, we got the alternator voltage back up to 13.5 and now the car starts, runs, and charges just perfect. So yeah, if you guys are having alternator issues and uh, you already tried a new alternator, didn't solve the problem, try this. Most likely this is going to be your problem. Very common issue, not only the Corollas, but a lot of Toyotas uh, in general. So I hope this video helps you guys out and uh, please like and subscribe and thank you guys for watching and good luck.